Hello YouTube and welcome to another Text Laws video. We are here with our new iPhone 5S and we want to do the setup of the phone, but this time we are don't setting it up as a new phone, but we are restoring a previous backup. I got here an iPhone 5, so you can head over to your iCloud settings and then into the backup menu and then activate your iCloud backup and do one of those i cloud backups. Uh, you can do this with your iPhone, with your iPod Touch and even with your iPad. And then when you are setting up the new iPhone or even a new iPod Touch or iPad, you can go to restore from iCloud backup. Then you have to sign in into your iCloud. Then you have to agree to the terms and conditions. Of course, yes. And then, if you have more than one iCloud backup, you have to choose between your different backups you have done. You can see here's an iPad mini backup, another iPad mini backup, and today I just did another backup with my iPhone 5. We choose this, this one. And then it starts restoring from iCloud. And this will take a couple of minutes, uh, depends how fast your internet connection is. So, and after a couple of minutes and two restarts, we are back in the game. We had to sign in again into our iCloud account and now we are in the setup uh, mode again. So we do have to do the rest of the setup. And there we are in our home screen. And as you can already see, all the apps are at the same place. Nothing is uh, strange here. But first of all, your iPhone has now to download all your apps again. Uh, this will take, of course, a, a long time, depending on how many apps and how big they are. And after this, you are ready to go. You can use your iPhone as the old one without any problems. So this is it. This is how to restore your iCloud backup on a new iPhone or iOS device. Thank you guys for watching and see you in the next video. Bye.